Hey everybody, welcome back. I love to play Sap. Faint trigger? Hmm, never mind. Mm, time to lose. Uh, I hate to play Sap. Let me be an edible suspect. Like if you, hey, we, we accuse um this O. Henry chocolate bar of murder. Your sentence is to get in my belly. I love to play um, Sap on a Monday right after the weekly comes out. Because I genuinely think... No faint triggers, huh? Sad. It's a sad story. I genuinely think um, a lot of people uh, just wait and see. Basically, they play the game like me. I don't know why I was trying to be diplomatic about it when I'm actually just going to insult myself. What I mean when I say they play the game like me is they just fiddle around for a week, four or five days at least, figure out um, what's beating them, and then replicate it. That's my strategy for Super Auto Pets right now, is like, see what the smart gamers are doing, and then copy it. Okay, we got place, we got place. So for right now, it's also, this is like the best time to play, because the meta's a little wide open. Eventually, you know, you'll just get killed by the same stuff over and over, and then you'll be like, oh, I know what I need to do. Here's how I'm going to become a scumbag. Where right now, like, I feel like it's it, early in the week, a lot of stuff can win. We almost got 10 wins with a porcupine last time, or we almost had some degree of respectability, at least, with a porcupine. Now I'm thinking, I'm like, where, where are we going from here? You don't get buffed. If we buy two, we go to four. Okay, here's what I'm thinking. Buy me, buy me. It's a very expensive apple-based purchase. <laughs> it's definitely, uh, it's a lot of apples um, that we've just paid three gold each for, which is, you know, I love to buy, I, I'm so crazy. Sometimes I feel like I'd rather buy an apple in this game than buy a pear, even though the stats obviously make that make no sense. We're gonna draw. I just, I, I felt like this was a very good time for us to be dropping those apples on the game. And maybe I'm incorrect, but for now, why don't you take one of those? And why don't you sell me? And why don't you buy me? And why don't you buy me? I don't think we're going to need the other frilled dragon, Pippin. Why don't you give me one of these? Now, it's, I, I would love to get a faint trigger, maybe. <clears throat> Without a faint trigger. Sure, I mean, I, I think an ox can be really good, but look, okay, here's, there's a lot of stuff to like here. A faint trigger gives us 2-2. Two, two. A 2-1 with a 2-2 that we could then pill. Or we could just take another mouse and, and basically run it back. We, we basically have one good unit. But, I mean, a 21-13 at this stage of the game is pretty disgusting. That should be relatively safe. <laughs> like, as, but the, the, to keep it up, we have to buy foods like every two seconds. But you know what I'm thinking here? I'm thinking forget the frilled dragon. Start to unwind it and then buy an apple. Well, they get a free apple, I should say. Oh, copy's always interesting. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say cooler heads prevail on this one for now. I'm gonna say no. Um, I'll be honest with you. I don't really think we're running a peacock long term, but I'll add one uh, to the team. Thusly. And I guess I want to make sure that you're getting the most HP, and then I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna pay three gold to buy you another apple. I'm hoping to get a level two tropical fish. This is a bit of a spicy team. We're, we're putting all of our hopes on the ladybug, of course. And it's not going to punish us. We're gonna be never punished as a result of this. That's incredible. But if we ever stop buying foods, it's gonna look pretty bad pretty fast. Well, you're at 13, 18. That's not too bad now that I think about it. It's not too bad. One of these. Really just need a tropical fish. I don't even think we're going level two peacock. I would I would sell you and I would place a deer. I'm still waiting for tropical fish, but in the meantime, why not a canned food? This may surprise you. It's more likely than you think. Canned food is a food as well. Now the frilled dragon has to go. I'm, I'm just waiting for a, a suitable replacement. I was I honestly very sensibly played on their part. I got to give you some credit for that one. Except I just killed your ox. <laughs> that felt, dude, when you kill an ox before it even gets a trigger, that feels, it's better than killing a kangaroo before it gets a trigger. I'm not, I'm not gonna be uh, stupid about this. Why don't you give me my level straight away? And then honestly, why don't you toss me a seal? This is a match made in heaven. And then honestly, 
why don't you sell me? Why don't you buy me a kangaroo? Just because it, we, we don't want the frilled dragon to suck up any of these buffs. We might as well. We might as well. We might as well. This is sensible. We might as well. I don't know what's going to happen with this deer, but if we can get the seal to level two reasonably quick, I think there's a chance for some kind of greatness here. This peacock's going to be very annoying. It's going to be mighty annoying. Make me think I'm mighty sick. No, oh, never mind. It's fine. I was so scared. It ended up being completely okay. So every food we buy is the food plus a plus four attack bonus plus a salad, basically. So every food comes with a side salad right now and a little ice cream. I mean, I don't know who you are. That's an amazing deal in my world. I don't really want to buy canned food right now, but it is plus four for our... It's plus four for our ladybug. It's like pretty tempting. And if we pivot, which we may, this solid as well. My seal. The one piece. No sweat. No, I'm not sweating. Not sweating. Not even sweating it, man. I would love a level two kangaroo. If, oh, I'm sweating slightly, but not enough to really be that bothered, but I'm, st I'm still sweating a little bit. And you know what? For one round, you're going to take a cucumber unless we get chocolate. No chocolate? Okay, take a cucumber because we also get the plus four bonus and then we also get the one ones. And then next round, hopefully, maybe we can start to see some chocolate and we got a pretty good thing going here. And again, I'm not really sold on our deer, our 411 deer, but life goes on. We're in a lot of trouble, actually. That is uh, that is not good. That is not good for us, what just happened there. It's a very bad situation. Skunk pretty much blew us out because we only have one strong unit. <laughs> very fair. That's very fair. Here's what I'll do. I'll level you. The, the food you got in your shop is better than the food you don't. Give me that, and then give me a taco. I'm begging you. It hit the seal. That's all I could ask for. The buffs are still getting distributed. Do you sell a tropical fish to throw a snake out there? I think you could. Or you could sell... No, you have to get the order exactly right. Yeah, well... I think our deer is actually not doing that much. What if you ran this? I can't afford it. That's why. That's why. At least... <clears throat> at least we're not on lethal. Because <laughs> that would hurt right now. That would hurt a lot. Probably still going to lose. Could I pray for a draw? Could I perhaps... I lived. Could I perhaps find you in... Uh, in, in find it in your heart to give me a draw? No? No? Okay. I don't think the deer would have saved us there. That's my only consolation right now. So you need one of these. And this would be a great, like, late... Oh, well, we, I'm not that worried about the tempura shrimp. Come on. You joking? You need to get sold. You need to get cowed. This is a lot of stats, man. I'm really rooting for me in this one. So here's how I think this goes down, okay? I think you buy a snake and you run the snake behind. You you run a squad. You run this squad for now. I know the snake at the back looks horrible. We we next time. Whoa! What is the no? <laughs> what is your tropical fish doing being the kangaroo, the benevolent kangaroo giver? Have you lost your mind? I, if it works, it's actually amazing because it means that our, uh, and it did work, it means that our kangaroo got some ill-gotten gains, but uh, oh, anyway, oh, it was horrendous. Either way, this is amazing. After being horrendous, it's amazing because we could do this, we could do this. This is fine. Move you further back. This is great. No scorpions, please. That would really kill. And then you need one of these so that you get most of the buffs, and then you should take the rest of the buffs that we can get from food, but not, not a pizza. It's too risky. Sure, that's a big one. Honestly, I freeze this just because it's targeted food. I would rather you have a lemon. I would, I would rather you have a lemon for certain. And I didn't save any gold. <laughs> Hi, Tomo. I am losing my mind. And I am foregoing all the benefits. Hold on, this still looks fine. T 
T-Rex just there for show right now? That's okay. That's okay, man. That's okay. Do you have, like, units? How is this... How is this happening? What a shot. What a shot. Hey, do it again. Oh no! My squad! It does not look fine. I'm dead. Okay, Tomo. I can't believe that only got six wins. It is user error. Tomo, you want to leave? Okay. Oh, here, here. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. We can leave. Go ahead. All right. I mean, I, we... If I'm being real with you, I think we had like a dream set up there. I hope we get the opportunity to try something like that again. Because I was having a lot of fun. Let me be a hooting whippersnapper. Always hitting baseballs through my front window going, ah. You know what's something you realize when you get a little older, by the way? If a kid breaks your window, no big deal. There's, it's, it's an accident. It happens. If it happens multiple times, maybe you got to talk with the parents. But like a one-time accident, ooh, pog, life goes on. However, when I was a teenager, what's the go-to phrase we use to vilify the older generation? It's always get off my lawn, right? Older I got, the more I realize, hey, why the heck are they on their lawn? They could be doing their shenanigans anywhere. Why are they doing it in front of my house and disturbing me? So I'm like, I, the older I get, the more I'm like, you know what, you can render a lot of criticism Onto all generations, including the older generations. But you shouldn't be on their lawn. That's their lawn. It depends. I mean, if you're like there to render a service, if you're there to mow it, to weed it, to fertilize it, I don't know, to put up a garden gnome or something like that. But otherwise, why are you, why are you loitering in someone's private residence? That's what a convenience store is for or like a coffee shop. I don't understand. Apparently, it's all Tropical Fish Weekly this week. I think that's completely okay. Um, so true. I, I hate to buy you, but I love to see you come. I mean, um, hmm, phrasing. We're going to go Peacock. Um, I think it's an, an incredible unit, or at least it has incredible potential. Look, I'm not really thrilled about it. But maybe there's a certain something to it? I really don't see us running like a shrimp build either. I don't really I don't really know what I see us doing in general, to be honest with you. I don't we, we don't really have a theme for the run except Peacock right now. And then buffing a tabby cat, even though we may never want to use a tabby cat long term, I don't know. This looks like a loss to me. Yes. You got, it, you got insane ant luck, but it, it could have been a loss regardless, I think. I think you got to go. You got to show up, get sold, get bought, buff this one. Looking for a level. That's our free reroll. Okay, no level. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to do one of these. Then we're actually going to move the peacock back slightly. And you know what? I'm socking it to you. Just give me a level next time. This is a pretty strong looking squad. The caveat is that we did also feed you like four times. So like, again, we gotta make that happen every time. It's a very, food is like a, it's an artificial stimulus right now. We gotta keep the, the printer going. I don't really wanna feed you a fried shrimp, to be honest, but I do, I, I like this and I don't mind running that for now. I really like, Getting the apples, like, on the house has been nice. I don't love the idea of, like, purchasing an apple at this stage of our life. But you know what? We're here. Let's give it a chance, I guess. I think as well... I mean, this is not, like, the best combine you're ever going to see. I think I like it just because... The tabby cat doesn't scale wide. It scales deep. So let's make our squad a little worse. We almost anti-cupcaked ourselves. And the reason we're going to do it is so that next time ooh, we don't have to spend as much money and we still get food. We basically bet that we were strong enough. And we were right, by the way, for all the, the haters out there. And then we get some two-cost apples. 
The apples are permanent one ones in addition to the extra HP we're getting. You know what? If we, smoke them if you got them. I'm running four squad here, and and I don't care who knows it. You can call me as no, no, no. This is the right way to set it up. Still, I think we probably lose this one, but we're very close to another level, and that's what I'm looking for. And I think that the cucumber. Well, now that I hear myself talk, I'm like. I'm not sure that a cucumber actually is worth um, what we spent, <laughs> which was not having a 50 unit here, but we did draw, so I'll take it. Levels. Holy cow, levels. I think you start here because it's a little cheaper. I think I have no complaints about what the seal has done for us last time, okay? So I think we just don't buy food yet. We wait till the next round to buy food. And the tabby cat, I, I get that you're probably like, well, it should go because it had the food, or it, it's the thing that you were feeding earlier. Uh, you know, in a perfect world, maybe, but you gotta remember, um, it's our best unit by far. So, I, I'm sorry, Hal, I can't let you do that. But we're gonna win this one anyway, which is very nice for us, very, very nice. And I know I don't know how many times at this point we've tried the seal. You're probably going to say too many. And you know the crazy thing is you might be right. Let's get... Freeze me a crocodile. Buy me. Buy me. Roll me. It's beautiful food. This, we're gonna buy the. Well, at least I gotta think about it. I gotta think about it because what if we use this the pair and it buffs the mouse? We're probably just happy to have the pair. We probably say that's not a big deal. Hold on, my squad's cracked. We're on five wins. We gotta scale even faster though. Please don't hit the mouse. Thank you so much. I, I'll never ask for anything else as long as I live. Five, two, three, two. It's real tempting. It's real tempting. Maybe, maybe put a poodle out there, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna forego it. You know what? I'm gonna. I believe in this. Oh! <laughs> How could Hannibal do this to me? It was such a high percentage chance, man. But either way, I'm still the crocodile is sick. I'm still happy to have it. Most of the time, it'll probably kill a scaler. I, it, look, it looks like it did amazing there. I don't actually think it did. I think that team was going down either way, but it, it did get a kill. It got a kill for nothing, so sure, that's great. I'm very upset. At least we have, like, a backup animal. I know it sounds, like, rude, but it's true. At least we have an animal where if the seal doesn't get a random food and the cat gets it, at least the cat is distributing some kind of buff. On top of also just genuinely, like, being our best unit. This is big. This is big. It's big. We're going to win this one. We're hanging in here. I knew this team could work, okay? We're already on seven. Chocolate. We want to see chocolates. I'm not going to be too picky about foods. I'll, I'll give you one of those. Every food comes with a guaranteed salad like this. It's not so bad. Now, would I dump you? You're giving four health a turn. I think I would dump you here. You've, you've served a great purpose, by the way. I don't mean to insult you, but... We're not gonna buy two things, so let's roll. Lemons, very important. Penguin, not so much. Chocolate is also important. Okay, well, honestly, I'm, I'd like to apologize to the lemon. No, we're gonna buy the lemon. It's the right thing to do. Even at the expense of running, like, unsquatted here. Because if we bought the cow and then fed the milk to the seal, we run the risk of um, not, we're, by the way, we're in trouble. <laughs> we run the risk of buffing the cow, which is something that we don't want to do. I, I think no matter what, we were going to lose this one, but this gives us, a, we were at a high chance of losing that one. But this one gives us a better long-term chance of, of getting a little further on. Now, because you've got, like, the, you're our best unit, basically, I'm going to make sure you have the melon. I know it seems backwards, 
I, I genuinely think it's the right play. Maybe you disagree. Maybe you're like, you got to go seal on that one. Well, it is what it is. You know, we've already done it. I don't, I don't really like an Orca that hasn't leveled up. I love this, though. I love this, though. I guess we have to run you just for, just for a round. What do you think? Not losing this one would be pretty huge. My melon, my melon armor, my armor, my melon. Oh, no, I think we're going to win anyway. I've been wrong before. Love it. Love to see that. That's why I don't trust the Orca, by the way. I was like immediately vindicated. You gotta just, I'd prefer if you didn't hit the crow, but it is what it is. Thank you so much. That is so kind of you. Now, I think at this point, you also need one of these. I also want you to not hit the crow. We're playing with, with freaking fire, man. And yet here we are, not being burned. I don't know what to buy. I'm gonna be 100% with you. I don't really feel like a... 3-3 three, three Crow is making that big of a difference. I think I would rather sell it and uh, just get another, like, five stat points out there on the units that actually matter. And I don't really think we're going skunk either. I got to figure out what we're putting out there. Maybe just things that you buy that give you stats immediately. It turns out a skunk would have been pretty, pretty freaking sick. <laughs> don't, don't crit me. Oh! We still draw. Two crits and we still drew. That's, that's very bullish. It's a great sign. Food me. Wow! <laughs> Hold on. A taper is like meaningless. Um, I guess we'd like a sauropod now, to be honest with you. And then just as many foods for our seal as possible. Again, not losing so that we're not on lethal is so important right now. I lived. It just gives us a much greater ability to, to ply our trade, you know? It gives us more runway to work with. They are going to spawn three roosters. It's not going to matter. That feeling when you know a 10-piece is coming. Oh, man. It feels good. Oh, it feels good. <laughs> oh, it feels bad. I'll take it. Or do you... What do you... Hey, let's live a little. Oh. <laughs> next time. Yeah, we'll live a little next time. I should not be so cocky. I mean, this team is really strong, honestly. I think we're still going to win. We are still going to win. Holy cow. Okay, that feels amazing. That feels great. I told you I'm not washed, and I told you a seal can work, okay? At least on a Monday. For now, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click the like button. It helps out a great deal. Of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. I'll see you next time. See ya.